and it's goodbye from us. And as your host for this last Southern program, here's a man whose bottom half has never been seen before on your screen, but whose face is familiar to you all. One of Southern's most popular station announcers, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Christopher Robbie. The herald of them all, John Benson. Thank you, John. Well, good evening and welcome, and I'm delighted, we're all delighted that you've joined us. And as the moment approaches, and on this occasion I don't of course simply mean that magical moment when Big Ben strikes midnight, but if you like, as our moment approaches, we're going to take a light-hearted, because New Year's Eve is a time for celebration and not for lament, so essentially a light-hearted look back at some of our achievements. Yes, that is the right word. Southern Fantasia, composed especially for us by Jonathan Burton and played there with their customary panache by the Bournemouth Sinfonietta. And I think we should take this moment to thank the Bournemouth Sinfonietta, thank their conductor, Owain Arwell Hughes, and also their colleagues in the symphony orchestra for the wonderfully warm and creative relationship that has built up between us over the years. And also, of course, for the many fine performances that they have given us, both in the concert hall and in this very studio. So, thank you. But, but please, don't go away, because we shall need you when we come to link arms at midnight. So, where are we? Uh, well, I've just said we're here in our main Studio One. A studio which has seen, my goodness me, during its life, an enormous variety of performance and spectacle. And none greater, perhaps, than when we gave the then unknown Grace Kennedy the star treatment. Oh. 